so got this thing loaded up we're gonna finish it at the house right now i just want to get up out of here before the shop close what up Sue? back at it we're about to have a crazy different day today we're about to go to vegas we got to go pick up something from the auction for me so stay tuned we got another pickup yes sir y'all see what's going on about to get to it yes sir good hunting Slide and got the trailer on the back. We are about to pick up another truck, y'all. I'm gonna tell y'all right now, y'all gonna be real surprised what I'm about to do and what I'm about to pull off and tell y'all. So stay tuned, man. We're getting closer. Got a four hour drive, me and my dog sliding. traffic we out here in vegas we made it had some traffic to go through we got a problem though your boy was super late so i had to contact my boy joshua who got the road glide the blue and gray one at the shop shout out to him he's at the auction right now with the new truck we just went and picked up man this is a new work truck so we can get out of this good truck that we got now i want to take care of this and keep it nice and cool i don't want to dog it out me here with oily fingerprints on everything everywhere so i found a good older truck that i already had for a good price so we're picking that up right now from the auction in vegas man so stay tuned y'all y'all gonna love to see this joint and love to see the work we about to get done in that joint man so stay tuned we working we getting it in we sliding yes sir man yeah we're about to go this way shout out to the homie man man hey my boy say the day today man <laughs> Shout out to the homie, man. Hey, good looking. He hey, he saved the fucking day, dude. We wouldn't even be able to get the truck. <laughs> man, yes, sir. This is crazy. They got all type of stuff. They done brought the truck out, man. I A A I. We at the auction, Ace. We have big trailer. Yep, we got big trailer. They got the truck out. Ooh, y'all know what time it is. We about to load up, man. Shout out to my boy, Joshua. Seriously, he didn't came through, man. Real shit. Let's load up, though. Yes, sir. We just pulled up in a truck, man. Got the truck going to work. Shout out my boy, CJ, letting me use the trailer. We got our truck, man. That's it right there, y'all. Let's check it out. We didn't drove five hours. This is the 2001 Silverado yes sir we got some wheels the paint is not that bad i know it's old but it's not that bad oh it's open oh yeah they didn't gutted everything out get the door panel right super dirty we're gonna clean it out yeah we gotta get this clean this is too dirty we're gonna get it right though y'all know at the auctions they make sure everything is going music and all that so no biggie we're gonna clean it up and get it right we got the 1500 the three door, I'm gonna see right now. Got the bed liner, that's cool. This thing coming together, man. This work, okay. Just gotta make sure everything function. Okay, we got some damage right there. Got the bed with a little bit of that with the door. Got some damage right there. Size that though, man, it's not that bad. Let's check it out. That mirror over there broke. Another little door situation. The hood already open, got the key. Super disgusting. We're gonna get this thing. It's, look how clean the, sun, the roof is though. The roof's super clean. I only got a little radio. Let's see the mileage on this joint. Let's see the mileage. Hold on, let's check it out. Okay. Gas on E, 150. Y'all know they sucked all the gas out of this joint. The hood open, so let's check it out, man. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, yeah, we got a clean 5.3 liter. I'm assuming it's a 5.3 and not a 6.0. But this thing is super clean, untouched. 
Yes, sir. And they got the electric fans. Yeah, somebody was taking care of this truck. Seriously. They got the electric fans on that joint, y'all. Y'all know these got the ones like the Yukon had with the big blade. The fact they got that, I know somebody was taking care of this. Yeah, that's crazy because this only has 150,000 miles. Let's see if we got any leaks. Got a little oil leak up there. Not leaving a leak. It's just a little drop. We're going to clean that. Two-wheel drive. Transmission looking good. Rear end looking good. Uh, making sure there's no damage under here. Like I said, we already paid for this. It's already mine. I just have to just go over everything, make sure everything is good. I'm glad it has a tail. I mean, uh, the hitch in the back with the spare. Because that other one that I wanted picked up, the Yukon did not have one. I had to install that. But I'm loving it, man. We got this for a real good price. We're going to reveal the price once we get everything how it's supposed to be. But this is the beginning, and I'm glad y'all see it, man. This thing looks good. We're going to get it together. It's only the beginning, y'all. So stay tuned, man. We got this thing looking good. A little dusty. But let's hear that. Let's hear that first startup, man, because we got to put it on the truck. So we're going to give it a first startup. Let's see. Let's see. Hold on, let me use my other hand. Oh yeah. 150,000 miles. Low fuel. This thing is looking good. I got the scanner, so we're gonna run that. I know they for sure took the fuel out. They for sure took the fuel out. Yes, sir, man. We're gonna get this thing going. Door lock, right? All right, cool. Making sure it's locked. Sound good though. Real quiet. This thing running strong. But that's crazy. So we're gonna get this thing right and cleaned up, man. I'm gonna go ahead and cut it off. Well, I'm gonna pull it up. Make sure we can get dry. All right. Reverse. As long as it go in gear fast enough. Oh yeah, this is a good transmission. Yeah, we in a game. This ain't bad, y'all. Yes, sir. Stay tuned, man. We about to load this joint up, y'all. Let's try to get this thing started. Oh yeah. They sucked all the gas out. I'm rolling. <laughs> so man, today was a success. Can I explain to y'all how stressful it was to drive out here? So like I want to get a biggest shout out to my boy, Josh, man. This would not be possible without him right now. We wouldn't have a truck. I wouldn't even be happy. I told him, I said, bro, if you don't be able to pull this off, I'm going to cry on the way back. And I just drove five hours. <laughs> so I'm glad everything worked out. Shout out to him. He the one that owns the Road Glide back at the shop. So best believe tomorrow, man, we're about to finish it up for sure. So stay tuned, man. We're about to get it in and get it done for sure. But yeah, so with the truck situation, I'm definitely going to hold on to it for now to work out of it so I can keep this truck in good condition. But if anybody else is interested in, in buying it or making me a sir, everything, everything strapped up, looking good. Got the lights working. At first, it was not working. Got it going. Yes, sir. Sliding. Yes, sir. We are on the freeway heading back on the 515. Sliding. Sir, we slide in. I done double, triple check the trailer. Yes, it's too dark. Yep, it's getting dark. It's crazy the time change. It would have been dark. But like I said, we slide and we getting on this freeway. We're about to probably make it safe. We good? Slide and up. Yes, sir. We are still driving right now. Sagging. We just got some more gas coming down the hill about to meet up with my boy everything's regular so stay tuned y'all we sliding I'm trying to drive safe this shit killing i think they got the foes with the double tires <laughs> hey this is hard i really wanted to get a hard ass picture in the light but i ain't even tripping we gonna have a time for sure this shit is hard as shit though for real my boy got that like joint, man. In the of nowhere in the hey, desert. no, for real. It's like literally nothing. <laughs> man, it's amazing to see we really be able to work for the things we want and really conquer and accomplish. It's unbelievable. The homie went. It's open. Yeah, no, it's open. Oh, okay, okay. okay. But, you know, I didn't want to watch the keys and everybody accident. 
<laughs> nah, hell no. This shit is hard, nigga. My homie got the big joint. That motherfucker huge. God damn. Yes, sir. We are sliding. We just pulled up, man. About to offload, just made it to LA, two in the morning. About to take these straps off, man. So let's do this real quick, quietly, so we can get to our bed. Yes, sir, back at it. About to go take the home in this trailer. Come on, let's get the truck right. Yes, sir, about to pull these joints out. Looking good. Nah, I'm gonna get one soon. About to pull them out. Yes, yeah, sir, this thing is dirty. We're gonna get them cleaned up. Get it cleaned up. Try to wash this joint. Then we're gonna go ahead and get this thing ready to go to the dealer to get that key fob situated. When we do it right here. No response, so I'm gonna take it to them. They're gonna get it right. Stay tuned for that first startup, y'all. Enter to win that joint, man. Sliding, sir. So we got the bikes put back up. We're about to go drop the trailer off to my boy. Can't even see that joint. There it go. We're about to drop the trailer off, come back, and then we're gonna get this work in. We gotta go to the shop and get some stuff done. Then we're gonna clean the truck up, man. So stay tuned. We're working. So we just dropped the trailer off back to my boy. Shout out to him for letting me use it to get the job done. Now we about to head back to my mom's. I'm about to clean the truck out we picked up yesterday from Copart. Stay tuned for that. We about to clean it out, try to renovate it as much as possible, take the seats out, get it right. It ain't the best looking truck, but we're about to make it look nice and decent, man. So stay tuned for that. We're gonna do that, then go back to the shop and help my boy out who helped me get the truck yesterday. We're gonna bring his bike, tow it to her house, tow it to my mom's. Then I'm gonna get it right there. Just because it's Saturday, the shop closed early on the weekends, then I really wanna do what he did for me that dude really helped me out yesterday so i want to show the same in return to him and had that bike rolling and ready to go for him today so stay tuned y'all about to get it in make it happen yes sir so we are in the copart truck right now man this thing has 158,000 miles we put some gas in it it has been running outside for like an hour right now i moved it around about to take it up and down the street i want y'all to see how dirty and filthy this is it is disgusting don't even trip you already know all of my services and my jobs and everything in my job description regards me cleaning. So you already know what I'm gonna do and how I'm gonna make this thing get a little shine to it. But before we start the bus down, let's get some air in this joint. AC does work, but I want some fresh air. It could be dust all in these air vents. So we're gonna do a quick little test ride down the block. Make sure everything is what it's supposed to be. And just make sure the transmission is working. You want to have the facts right when you're trying to sell to people. Let's go for it, y'all. Yes, sir. This thing, get up. Yes, sir. Got the brakes work. Got to check everything. Yes, sir. This thing is working good. So I'm talking about. Yes, sir. Got this thing coming. First, got a car coming. Come on, man. Yes, sir, this is looking good. I'm actually happy this is working, because I'm telling y'all that Yukon I just had, had 230,000 miles and the transmission went out. This got 158, so we still got about 70 before we even could think something like that is about to happen. But it's definitely running strong. It's feeling good. The brakes is working cool. It's sounding good. We're gonna clean it up and try to get this thing detailed out so we can go ahead and get it on its way, man. But we'll see what's going on. We got this thing running and going. It's nice and smooth, running and driving. It's doing what we're supposed to be doing. Yes, sir. I'm telling you, this motor sound good. Oil pressure looking good. Voltage, temperature. I'm gonna run the check engine light in a second. We're gonna check the hood. Show y'all how clean this engine is. Sound super quiet. Got the electric fans on there. Thing 
It's looking and sounding good, man. Y'all see it? Let's get this thing cleaned up, though. I'm going to just take the air and blow them dry. Yeah, I'm going to just scrub it and try to get all this stuff out, all this dirt. So we're cleaning it out. Got the inside, we got that seat out. Y'all know it wouldn't be me if we didn't get the seat out. I stripped one of those boats on accident, so I'm gonna leave that one. So we're gonna get this one out. So we gotta deal with these type of boats so we can get all this dirt out and clean it up, man. Y'all see what's going on. This thing is so disgusting. It's crazy. It wouldn't be me if these seats didn't come out. That's the only way this thing is getting clean. Yes, sir. Y'all see all this dirt. About to clean it all up though y'all see all this man just remember all of this y'all looking at so we got the seat still out looks a lot much better it's not the best i still want to scrub the carpet but it definitely is a lot much cleaner got everything wiped down looking a lot much better console top cup holder everything is looking a lot much better Everything, I'm just wiping all this out. Just cleaning this. Thing is, people don't clean up after they sell. Whoever had this truck, I'm pretty sure their house looked the same way right now. What you see people's cars like is what their house look like. That's real. So, shout out to people with the clean cars. But this thing coming, I'm about to just revacuum. Got everything cleaned up though. All that gunk, all that dirt is finally out. Looking a lot much better. Yes, sir. We got the back seat in. I'm about to put the front. Now see how much better it's looking though. Got this thing coming together. Yes, sir. We got this thing looking a lot much better, man. Took the seats out, got this thing looking so much more decent. Everything is cleaned up, looking nice as it should. Now it's a wrap. We gotta just go ahead and get this thing ready for the wash. So stay tuned. Got it all cleaned up. Time to go get this Harley. Pick it up from the shop. Yes, sir. Let's put up to the shop to grab the road light out. That's the CVO bags and the CVO front and back floorboards I ordered. We got the Street Glide Texas. You about to be on the way, I promise you. We got that joint heading out, one out. You up next, bro. About to be sliding. Yes, sir. We got this thing loaded up. We're going to finish it at the house right now. I just want to get up out of here before the shop closes. So my boy got some faith to ride this weekend. Stay tuned, y'all. We sliding. All right. We out of here. Locked and loaded. Strapped tight. Got the lights on the trailer working. It's my boy trailer again. So I'd be appreciating the homie allowing me to use these joints. Cause I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I don't want to dog this truck out and I really don't want to be riding them bikes in the back like I used to. I don't mind if I have to, but if I don't have to, I ain't doing it. Y'all see it. Got everything in the car loaded. So we're about to get it all together. Stay tuned.
start. This thing starts right up, no hesitation. Let the fuel prime. Got right on. I'm gonna run that check engine light as soon as I get to my apartment and get to my scanner. But stay tuned. We only got the seatbelt and the check engine. But yeah, I'm about to park this joint, man. Appreciate y'all for watching. Let me know what y'all think from the complete before till now. Did y'all think I was gonna clean it this good? What y'all think, man? Let me know in the description below. Appreciate y'all for watching. I gotta get that speaker cover. First test ride, y'all. Got the bike in the back. Stay tuned.